Hi and welcome to Enable Cooking, my YouTube cooking channel. My name is Martin. I have been a professional chef for the last 20 years, working in five continents all around the world for award-winning restaurants and hotels. And uh, the last 10 years, uh, I lost my vision, so I'm vision impaired, legally blind, and I'm also a guide dog user. And of course, my guide dog Kayla is always with me. Just have a look here, she's always very close, particular where the food is. Apropos food, today I want to show you a dish which is very, very simple uh, to do. It's a fish fillet baked in the oven. And it's going to be a whole meal because all the ingredients which you're going to choose, they're going to all cook or bake in a paper bag at the same time. So once you have put it in, after 12 or 15 minutes, depending on the thickness of the fish fillet, uh, you take it out and you have a whole meal in front of you. The ingredients we're going to use for this dish is, I chose salmon fillets, Tasmanian salmon fillets, uh, the best salmon fillets you can get around here, skinless, no skin, very important. All right. Then uh, some potatoes, starch, just sliced, raw, cherry tomatoes, we got some sliced leek, some mushrooms, some fennel, sliced fennel and the fennel herbs, we got some blanched green uh, beans, they need to be blanched so they keep the color, also some blanched garlic, otherwise it will be too sharp, too spicy, um, some olives and uh, sun dried tomato, and again some herbs from the garden, we have some rosemary, some basil and some Italian parsley. And of course, what we also need is salt and pepper, very important, always uh, sea salt flakes, some lemon juice, olive oil, some Worcester, and some balsamico. And at the end, of course, we need some baking paper, the tray, and the preheated oven to 200 degrees. Okay, now we're going to build this baby, all right? We're going to take the baking paper and just put it onto our chopping board. We take our sliced potatoes for the base, okay? We're going to build like a house, okay? Pretty much, we, we diagonal, we put it in there, all right? So probably two or three. We also will take some fennel, a sliced fennel, okay? And we want two more slice of the potato. Now very important already, we have to put a little bit of salt and a little bit of pepper. All right. Now the main ingredients, we're going to put the Tasmanian salmon fillet and we put it on top. All right. So it sits on like a little bed. Okay. All right. And now we start to build around our flavors which we want to have. So we're going to put some green beans around. All right. With a little bit for color. Okay. We put the blanched garlic here, all right? Then we put some cherry tomatoes, a little bit around, okay? And some sliced mushroom, you can put even one on top, one here on the side, sliced leek, um, a little bit of herbs from the fennel, the fennel grass, it's gonna be a beautiful fragrance, all right? Um, we have the olives, Okay, black olives, we're going to put one here, one here, some sun-dried tomatoes, um, we're going to put some basil, okay, you can see all this fragrance, all these flavors will come through once we're going to bake it in the oven. It's going to bake inside this bag and this will give a lot of flavors. Rosemary on top, which eventually at the end we can take off, we're just going to use it for flavor because you can't eat these bits, they're going to be too hard, these needles. Now once we have that all on, we're going to season again, sea salt, okay, black pepper, and then we're going to add on a little bit of lemon juice, already squeezed, all right, if you're not sure, just put your hands here so you know what's coming out, because you don't want to put too much, otherwise you only have lemon flavor there. One of the key ingredients as well, olive oil, all right. And some moisture, a little bit of vinegar, balsamico for a little bit of bite. That's it. And a bit of water. 
Once we have that, I'm going to actually wrap this all around. So basically what we're going to do, we fold it over like this, okay, and it's closed here. And on the sides, we're going to wrap in, alright. So basically we want to create this a closed kind of bag, which you can see right now here. Alright, we take it, put it onto our baking tray, And then it goes into the oven, preheated oven, 200 degrees for around 10, 12 minutes. Okay, now the fish is ready. Okay, we're gonna take it out. So around 12 minutes for the salmon fillets. Just gonna open the oven. Make sure we have a towel, ovenproof heat towel. And you just put it out here. Okay, close the oven. Okay. You can smell, you can smell all the herbs, all the ingredients, all the flavorings which we added in here, you, you can smell it, it just comes through, it's fantastic. Now, we want to put that down onto a plate, okay, just a spatula, put it up here, okay, now we can open it, alright, so now you get a whole meal in front of you. the whole steam coming. So you can serve it straight like that, all right? Keep, people can eat it straight like that, the fish is on top. You just take the rosemary off, okay? Just keep it on the side. You have no extra plates to wash, no extra pots, no nothing. Just a tray, the oven, baking paper, and that's it. Bon appetit, and till next time. Thank you.